Don't pretend like well, you we got it. there a little slimer. Oh man, you, you know what they gotta do with the first Frankie? fish, right? Oh, let me see that. Hey, well, we just got out here, didn't get a chance to get any video going, but uh, what have we been out? Five minutes, got a nice five little minutes. snake. Not even five minutes, yep. nope. Nice, you know, nice windy, slimer. Windy out today, so we figured let's do a little shore fishing. Ten yep. minutes from Duluth, St. Louis River, let's see what That's we can right. catch. Yeah, you know, I grew up around these parts too. I was <laughs> I uh, was catching fish here before I could grow hair on my face, so the first mushroom known, I was coming back to give him a, another round at yep. it. And you gonna give that guy a kiss? Yeah, first, first fish. <laughs> oh. Back to the Jesus, you're kissing it like your mom or kissing it like your girlfriend? Yeah, you want to shoot on the line, but you know what? You gotta cut to these so you can get to the bigger one. So we're there gonna we treat go. it with the same respect as we would treat a big, beautiful walleye. We're gonna give her a kiss and we're gonna send her away. Yep. Nice little night at the marina. I haven't oh, even. Yeah. Tied up my line yet, you know. Jeez. Allowed two see. poles, got a bobber pull out, but got two fish on my line, and this kid hasn't even tied his his uh his pole up yet. There you go. Got the luck today. Woke up on the right side of the bed well, or something. Technically, uh, technically, I think that was on my pole, but I guess I'll take it. Got a nice little crappie. You gotta start got somewhere. A nice little assist for Frankie. Yeah. 60-40 split, I'd say. Probably keep that one. Start somewhere. Yep. That's right. You gotta wake up, drink a couple more energy drinks, huh? There you <laughs> go. <laughs> Tobias, you're up, brother. Yep. Number two. Wanna go join your buddy in there? Yep. Just walking kind of back and forth, and normally on my last one, it was kind of playing with That's my That's a hook. nice crappie there. Oh yeah, this Hold one. Hold it up sideways, let's see it. Here, let me That's a fat crappie. Add her to the bucket. We found, we found a little oh, crappie bite going on. That's right. Out of nowhere, the thing just took my uh, fatter than your girlfriend. Jeez. <laughs> Where's your fish, bud? I don't think you can be chirping. Yeah, that's right. Nice fish. Frankie's got another bite going. He's got the hot hand. This will be his sixth. Fish on, crappie. Fish on. Jeez, buddy. Jeez, Showing us how it's done, my, uh, huh? Hey, this is Another what it's supposed nice to eater. look like when you catch one. Uh, Another nice just eater. Just in case you forgot what it's supposed to look like. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like that right there. That'll I don't know what I put on my hook this morning, but six. just can't keep them away. Yup, that'll be number six there. Six to zero to zero. I get a half. One of them was yeah. on my pole. Yeah, we'll give you a half point. And you're doing better than my brother. He's just the dead weight around here. Thank God we bring you along. Yeah, at least I hope you're having fun. We don't bring you along for your company. We bring you along for your fishing ability, I'll tell you yeah, that. That's right. Woo. Nice fish. What do we got here? I finally struck some blood. Nice little crappie to add to the little meal. Nice little one, have. crappie. Heck yeah. Hitting on that scroll that I found, huh? Yep. Nice little fish. A little late to the pot. Better late than never, huh? Yeah. Get it in. <laughs> Fish on, baby. My turn. Took me a while. There Woo! we go. That's a nice We found a nice school today. Baby. There we go. Woo! That looks awfully like the other one we you just caught like a couple seconds ago, but that's all right. <laughs> Just hooked up. Last fish of the day. Last fish of the day. Did you crappy? Woo! Here you go. Beautiful. Boy, Last fish of the day. There you go. Sorry about the wind noise here. Obviously, we're getting a little cold, but we put a hell of a bucket of uh, crappie together. Yep, that's who we nice got. Nice little couple hours on the St. Louis. Not a bad one, huh? Uh, there we go. Woo! <laughs> Here we go, pay your respect. Thanks, buddy. Pay your respect. Last one of the night. We had a great night. Come check out this little uh, freezer full. Cooler full, I mean. Wow. One, yeah. two, three, four, five, six. And that's a nice one right there. Not a, uh, not a bad day on the St. Louis for the boys. Huh? Hey, good day on the secret spot. Watch this. Oh, yeah. the secret spot never disappoints. Get a little handful of the big boys. Oh, man. Oh, showing off my fish. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say? Hey, what do you say for uh, all the folks that that you know really would love to come out here and catch fish like we are, but they're just really they're just not having any luck. What would you say to you those know, type of fishermen? Put in the time, put in the effort, and believe in yourself. You know, 
We just came out here. We did simple fishing. What did we do? We went and dug in your dad's garden, found a couple of worms. Yeah, didn't buy the worms. You know? No, found no, a couple no. of worms. I think you're onto something there, Hogs. Hey, I think, I think we figured something out. They like the Hanson worms. Oh. They're the ones from our backyard. I think that's what we got them on. Here we go. There you go. I'm gonna cook these bad boys up, make a oh, good one. Oh, yeah, meal. let's go. Yeah, Stay tuned. Give it up. Stay yep, tuned. That's All right, now we're gonna get to the portion of cleaning these nice crappies. Let's start with the big mamba jamba. Let's start with the jumbo. <laughs> We don't really have a table to work on, but we'll make do with the cooler and a little piece of wood. There we go. Hope there's nice sharp. Yep. Oh, it'll work. So yeah, just start with a little cut right behind the gill plate. Gill plate cut. Jeez. Look, this gonna is have gonna have some nice fillet. Oh yeah. yeah. Big. <laughs> we'll be eating good. And uh, can you tell us what what type of knife you're using there? I have no idea. This is some old, old play knife that my uh, grandpa gave me. Okay. You can see how many times it's been sharp and there's barely any blade left on it. Oh man. Yeah, it'll do the trick still. I brought another one in case this one's not sharp enough, but it'll work. So I'm coming along the rib cage here. Trying to get as much meat as possible. Yup, don't waste any meat there. No, we don't want, we're not, uh, we're not the YouTube channel that wastes meat, right? No. So if you're looking for that, you're in the wrong place. You're in the wrong place. Yeah. So the big thing is where people miss on uh, fish is the belly meat. You belly, we want to keep all that belly meat, huh? Yeah, that's where if people, if they're not great flares. I mean, see, I missed a little up here. Yep. But I mean, you get some of this. Pretty good. Oh yeah. Not a bad little flay. Oh yeah. It'll come through. And to not bore you with the whole process, I'll quickly uh, just show you one half of a fish here. So, like I said, I kind of missed a little belly meat here, but crappies do have some bones that run right down the middle here. So I'm just gonna take my knife, make a little cut. And then pinch the skin with my fingernails and slide along the skin. So that will be good eating them, huh? Oh yeah. So for, for a crappie fillet, they don't get much bigger than that. No. And so for the folks at home who might not be as experienced uh, filleters as you are there, what would what what type of advice would you give them? Uh, practice, practice, practice. Um, that's definitely the advice with cleaning fish. You you're gonna probably butcher the first one you do. Yeah. But uh, the only way to get better is and get the hang of it all is just by repetition. Yup. So yep. yeah, there's a half a fish down. We've got uh, five and a half more to get through, and I think we'll have a nice little bowl at the end. There we go. Okay. Uh, another thing, if you don't, uh, if you're not an experienced um, filleter, what you can do is just always make sure you go out fishing with Hogan, because then he'll clean all of <laughs> your fish <laughs> for you. <laughs> That's <laughs> true. <laughs> Six crappies. Six crappies. I think that'll be enough for a meal. For no, three, I think yeah? so for the three hungry young fellows right here. You know, what's the side gonna be? Are we gonna be healthy, have a little salad? Maybe salad, or? maybe oh, yeah. some rice. For potatoes. another day, though. Maybe get a good soon. workout in and then. Yeah. Hey, stay tuned and subscribe so you can see what, what subscribe. the product is. <laughs> subscribe, like, share, comment. <laughs> uh, we want your know. feedback. Yep. Yo, I do want your feedback. <laughs> we hey, want what, are we doing, feedback. what are we doing wrong? What can we do better? There you go. That is correct. Right into the fridge. Right into the fridge. There we go. Turtle man. <laughs> <laughs> Eat this uh, delicious little crappies. And we're going to start with a little uh, shore lunch, you know, so we got to get Yeah, so what lunch. do we got for the folks here? We got to get the eggs going, you know? Just the original recipe then, huh? Just the original. All right. Nothing Noth special here. Nothing fancy. We'll, we'll add a couple extra ingredients though, not that. There we go. Right. You just get your eggs going here. There we go. Hey, you show the people the asparagus too? Oh, we will. Don't even All forget right. about the asparagus. You gotta be healthy here. Eat a little That's bit right. like rabbits. That's right. If you don't have the best utensils here, you're using a knife to whisk her up. <laughs> you want a fork? That'll do. Yeah. A little whisk. Hey man, what are you gonna do when you're in the woods and all you got is a 
is a stick. Yep, then he just whisks with yep, the stick, right? Exactly. You go find a wild chicken. Hey, exactly. Get a pop an egg. Exactly, man. These videos are meant for the city folk. Yep. And uh, we got to thank Frankie with some uh, beautiful music he's playing right now. That's right, yep. I got a hinge profile too, so... <laughs> I'm on the market. <laughs> So yeah, you're going to fill it up with a little bit. I'm not going to put all of it in because I don't think we're going to need it all. And then just a simple process. Maybe make sure the oil is hot before we uh, add the fish though, you know? Oh yeah. Oh, Woo! She's good to go. Man. So in the egg bake. In the bag, we'll start off with both four because that will probably fit the pan pretty good. Nice old crappie fillets here. That way when you oh, shake there, there it, you, go. you know, it's got room to mix around. There you go. There you go. Ooh, yeah. Hmm. You're just going to take your battered fish. I mean, you could use a little more batter than that. We'll probably add a little more next time. Just listen to that the sizzle. sizzle, <laughs> baby. Woo. We're eating good tonight. Oh yeah. So yeah, we'll repeat the process here and then show you a little bit about the asparagus and how it's done in the end. You gotta sign off. Live <laughs> <Blah>, action. <laughs> right, straight from the Hansen Garden, some wild chives. There you go. We're gonna, it's gonna be a perfect garnish. One thing you gotta do for the camera is untuck your shirt so you don't look like a dweeb. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so look at, hey, get the camera over here now. We got, uh, we got some nice chive here. Yep. Should make a perfect garnish for the. Uh, there you go. People nice chives quick. right there. We'll there cut you those go. things up. Go so around there. Ooh. Look at that. So it's done right there, huh, Hogan? Oh, we're eating good tonight. Oh, yep. man. Oh, boy. Ooh. Ooh. Keep me away from that, huh? Can we get a nice flip? Give her a flip. Oh, she's oh, breaking man. up. She's ready to go on the plate. All of them? Plate her up. Plate her up? Maggie, you on your already mentioned year, to the video. Did you do any smelting this year? Yeah, me holding one. The fish is ready. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Oh. Salt, <laughs> salt, salt <laughs> can. Get, get to the can. Give me some Hey, so we're gonna yep. we're chopping up a little bit of garlic right now. Nice. Um, and we got a, we already got a hot pan and we got the uh, the nice juices from that uh, from those beautiful crappie. So we're just gonna throw them in and. Let these uh, sizzle for a, for a few minutes and then add the asparagus. Nice. So I think that's probably the plan for these guys. I'll tell you what, if you guys don't cook on cast iron pans, it's the only way to go. It's the only way to go. Hey, we got a link in the bio. We got a link in the bio for uh, for you folks that uh, need need a uh, need a website to try to find one. No, we all, don't. We, we don't. don't. <laughs> hey, hey, we don't take commission for it. It's just our recommendation. <laughs> There's a. Uh, so much wild asparagus that goes. Yes. We already threw some garlic in there, so we're just gonna throw the asparagus and get them going. Nice cast iron pan, so you know we're gonna get a good simmer. Oh yeah. Through the way. You single ladies. That's right. Hit me up. Find me on hinge. <laughs> <laughs> some good looking plates of food right there. There we go. You wanna Ooh. get the 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 freeloader with the small plate? And <laughs> oh, come plate. over. The Did he catch the fish? The small grub didn't catch yeah. it, but he can but try it. The beer? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there we go. There we go. Eat up, boys. Go. How's it taste there, sir? Unreal. Tap. Pretty good. Pretty good. 
Molly's ironing up over here. Maggie. Maggie. <laughs> <laughs> Maggie's ironing up over here. <laughs>